Hi, we're here with David Griswold, who's the president of Sustainable Harvest, which is based in Portland, Oregon, and it's a green coffee importing company, and also the legendary Guido of La Marzocco. And, and one thing that I'm really interested in is because David is from the green coffee side and Marzocco is the end user side, why was it important to you to bring David to this event, Guido? Thank you for the introduction, I'm flattered. Um, it's, it's, it goes along with the mission of the company to be meaningful f with co in coffee. As an espresso coffee machine company that thinks about coffee as a whole. So for us, it was very important to have David here because during the course of my career, I've been following, I've been following, following David on coffee talk, uh, let's talk coffee, sorry and at several conventions in which he spoke, and I was very inspired by his vision, out-of-the-box vision, I should say, or I could say, uh, about incentivizing farmers to do a better job and making meaning, making significance, make community, and this is what Lomorzoko does in a different end of the business. So we were very inspired by him, and we wanted to inspire him back and show him that we are doing similar things on our end of the world, or the distribution chain, and also, I think he has the greatest story to tell in the industry nowadays. And I'll let David talk about his, his story because it's so interesting and I'm sure it's going to inspire everyone, as it did to Lamarzocco. Thank you. Thanks. David, you're no stranger to the barista side of things. You've actually incorporated it into your annual event, Let's Talk Coffee. Tell us why that's important on your end to, to bring both all those sides of the of the chain together. Well, I think I think when you when you realize it's re the problems that we face in coffee are only going to be solved if we start to work together and collaborate. Collective action is always hard and the only way it can really happen is just sort of individuals starting to know the situations of other individuals. And when it comes to a coffee supply chain, it's baristas knowing who are the farmers, what are the challenges they face and vice versa. And so bringing baristas in the way we did with our seed to cup barista challenge was all about getting baristas to connect with farmers and for farmers to sort of connect back. And it seems to work uh, every time. It changes lives. And even here at this event, I went over and had a shot of espresso this morning. It was a Peruvian coffee. And it was from the baristas who had gone in 2010 to that farm, that farmer's farm. They're still buying the coffee. And they were very excited. Um, you know, those, those are the kinds of stories that really keep you moving forward. David is here as the keynote speaker of the Out of the Box event. I'm curious, this is your first Out of the Box experience. What do you think? I, you know, it's, it's, uh, it is, it's, it's something I wasn't expecting to see. I guess what I sort of sense here is the level of enthusiasm. Um, there's a lot of innovation. And people are just very pumped. And I know uh, we'd always say, well, of course, there's a lot of coffee being served and things like that. But people are very excited about what's possible with with this with La Marzocco and with the kinds of machines that are being done and there's a real there's a real ambiance here and that's what the industry needs the industry needs uh, new creative thinkers and it's it's great to see so it's been fun thank you so much david thanks thanks